Many golfers, especially in the capital cities, take for granted the opportunity to play golf every day. Over several years, Your Golf Pro has worked with many remote communities across Australia. And we're lucky enough to go visit Ulara, which is at the base of Ayers Rock, where we have a very special guest waiting for us. G'day, Deborah. Hey Mark, slightly different weather to where you are in Sydney. We're here at beautiful Uluru with the guys from Your Golf Pro. Say hi guys! Hey! hey. We're very excited about the next couple of days. I'm gonna curve to the right. Yeah. Oh! oh. oh. I see the grip running to the middle section for these things. Let's just set up perfectly. Oh, no. you put your feet to the of your shoulders. Righto. And here we go. Well, I'm here with Chris Rutherford, who is the pro at one of my favourite golf courses, Royal Queensland. Here we are sitting in the middle of Uluru, which is great. Now, tell me, obviously we're talking about remote golf. How long have you been involved with it? Six years. We hosted our first clinic at Alice Springs six years ago, where we had 507 children and 50 golf professionals to the event. From your point of view, why is remote golf so important? Just to give op children that don't necessarily get the opportunity to be exposed to the game of golf that opportunity. Here, we hosted the clinic here last year. We don't have a golf course here, but it didn't stop us giving the opportunity to the children. But at Alice Springs, we've got a fantastic Peter Thompson designed golf course there that we used for the uh, used for the clinic. Right. And did you see any talented kids that got the got the move? Lots. 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 It just came naturally to a lot of them. All we had to do with some was just demonstrate, show them how to grip the golf club. We'd hit a few shots for them. They just mimic us and just did a wonderful job. That's great. You would have made their day. Yeah. I love the program. Wish you the best of luck with it. Thank you. Okay. We're going to be chatting to Tyler next, who's actually part of the trainee program, and he'll be participating in the golf clinics. Well, I'm here with Tyler, who's part of the trainee program at Voyages. Tyler, thank you for sitting down and having a chat with me. Yeah, Rob. So what's it mean to have remote golf for you and to have all the professionals come out here and give the clinics? Um, it'll be actually pretty good. It's, um, I like the game, it's pure social too, so you get to interact with a lot of people. Social, yeah. Yeah, and it's a, it's a good hobby, actually. So are you any good? Um, I, I play every now and then, not that good. Okay. I wouldn't say I'm, I'm average. Yeah. So what does golf sort of mean to you? What, what does the sport bring to you, do you think? If I actually took golf up, it would just be like um, probably another hobby for me. Just, just something to do, mm. get, um, get something to do in my free time. So what are you looking forward to the most with the clinics? I'll uh, just probably just actually to learn probably how to play golf. <laughs> like I've taught myself before, or I had my dad, we had played golf there. But then um, it would actually just be nice to actually, actually learn how to hit it properly, yeah. the stand, how to hold it, what um, pearl golf stick it is what um, time to use it, Yeah. what areas of the golf field. So There's so many elements to this game. So many, yes, exactly. Yeah. Is. So but I suppose it's all about with the clinics of just asking the questions and getting as much yeah. information as you can. Just to learn all that small kind of bits. Yeah. Listen up, I just want to wish you um, all the best yeah. with your training program. It sounds like you've got a really busy job trying to yeah, keep everybody I happy. It. I love it. <laughs> yeah, good it's stuff. Good okay, nice to talk to you, Tyler. Nice to talk to you. Thank you. Thanks, Tyler. <laughs> The remote program today uh, really achieved some goals that we've tried to uh, develop a program going forward. So over the next 12 months we've committed now to a, a quarterly program out here at Ayers Rock and the trainee system as well. So we really look forward to coming back over the, the next three quarters. The experience has been fantastic. It's just great to see kids who otherwise wouldn't have had an opportunity to pick up a golf club actually having a good time and trying out the sport and that wouldn't have happened uh, if uh, the guys hadn't come out here. Just to see um, all the guys getting to hit some golf balls and, and really just enjoy being active was it was just really really good and uh, like I said very unexpected. Golf can be such a vehicle for everybody and uh, if we can provide a little bit of happiness out here and some of these guys might go back and uh, want to play the game and they've learned a few life skills off us. You can play golf anywhere and everywhere and it's, uh, it's a game of uh, life so um, doesn't matter what age, you should really uh, look at trying it out and uh, enjoying what golf has to offer. But it's important for us to be able to maintain that momentum on going post, post us leaving. So by inducting staff into the national program that both governing bodies are running, the MyGolf, and allowing them and providing them the tools and the structure to be able to conduct similar sessions like today, you know, it gives us the confidence that 
this this work that's been so hard to put together it will have impact and a result that's ongoing. It's been a really um, quite an amazing experience for me actually just to come out here um, we're at the school which is where they do the training programs but to, to look at the faces and to see them just engaging with the golf pros and just going out there and having hitting a few balls um, and just talking to them and asking questions and they're loving it, they're absolutely loving it and they're just engaging in something that they they haven't before and I think that's really what it's all about is just opening up their world and showing them that there's a bigger world out there if they apply themselves and, and, and golf's one of those things, it's, it's a, a game of connection uh, and meeting people and that's I think what we've achieved today really well.